Hey there, Justin from Blaze. Autopilot does a great job automating the marketing process, but it's important to know how to view and edit the posts that Autopilot creates on your behalf. There are a few ways that you can view your posts. The most straightforward way is using the calendar tool. Simply select calendar from the sidebar to see the current week that you're in. You can use the tools at the top of the calendar section to change the content that you see. You can jog the view forward or backwards using the arrow keys. Adjust the view and even add filters if you want. You can use the Select Files tool to select multiple posts, and this tool is great for batch actions like deleting content or regenerating content. The New Post button is used to generate additional content. An alternative way to look at content is using the Projects or Folder view in the sidebar. Each week that Autopilot creates your content, it will also create a project or a folder on the sidebar and name it for that specific week. Then all of the content generated for that week gets placed in that corresponding folder. While at first glance, accessing your posts from the folder view appears to be about the same as the calendar tool, but the project view includes the table view here. Click calendar and then change it to table view to access it. This provides additional insights into your content. By default, you have access to information like post status and post date, as well as post time, but you can also visualize other data that might be relevant for staying organized. Let's jump back into the calendar view for a second to select a post to review. Blaze uses two different tools to edit content inside of, a document editor to edit text-heavy documents like blogs and newsletters, and a visual editor for editing images and designs. We'll briefly cover both tools in this video, but to start, make sure you're selecting a social media post. I'm gonna go ahead and select this LinkedIn post. Notice you get a preview of that post with some helpful information on the side. Here, you can see the post's schedule date and time. Click it to open a menu that will allow you to change the date and time. You can also unschedule the post if you want, post it right away, or use the button at the bottom to confirm the date and time changes that you might make. In the edit section, click captions to make changes to the captions of the post. A pop-up window will appear allowing you to make changes. You can use regenerate to have Blaze completely rewrite it if you want. You can also just review and make edits manually as well. Once you've made all your changes to your captions, click save captions to confirm them. Clicking visual will take you into designer to make edits to the image. Designer is our fully featured image editor that's like Canva, but way better. Single clicking on an element on the canvas will select it. Once selected, you can click and drag the element around to reposition it. You can resize it or even rotate it. Options for selected objects appear in the pop-up toolbar and in the sidebar. Clicking replace will open a pop-up window to select a different image. I'm gonna go ahead and back out of this though. Double-clicking the image will allow you to crop it if you want. Deselect the image by clicking off of it. Editing text elements is similar. A single click on your text layer will select it. Once selected, you can click and drag the object to move it around. You can adjust the size, scale, and rotation as well. Double-clicking the text layer will let you edit what the text says. You can also use the tools at the top of the window to add more items to your canvas, as well as make other changes. When you select a tool, options for that specific tool appear in the sidebar. Elements, for instance, shows you shapes, frames, and icons. There are a few shown in each category, and even more options can be shown by clicking See All. Simply click on an item to add it to the canvas. The Media tool allows you to add additional videos and images to your canvas. The Templates tool allows you to swap out the entire design with something from the template library. The Backgrounds tool lets you change your background. The Resize tool allows you to change the aspect ratio of your post and even change what platform you're posting to. And the Brand tool can be used to add your logo to the canvas and sample different color combinations from your brand kit. I'm gonna go ahead and add my logo to the canvas and make a few adjustments. All right, there, that looks better. We have standalone videos that dive deeper into each of the tools inside a designer if you want to become an expert. Once you've made all your changes, you can go back to the preview screen or you can go back to your calendar view. I'm going to go back to my calendar view. 
Okay, from here, select a blog to walk through the process of reviewing and editing with text-focused content. Just like before, you can preview your content. You can adjust the schedule, date, and time, and you can also jump into the document to make changes. I'm gonna do just that by clicking Document. Now you're inside of Blaze Documents. Think of this as a supercharged version of Google Docs. And as you can see, the sidebar is chocked full of features and tools designed to make your blog even better. Feel free to explore these when you get a chance. You can use the Elements tool located at the top of the screen to add in images, tables, and other document-focused items as needed. At the bottom of the document is our AI prompt toolbar that you can use to ask Blaze for some AI-powered help to edit or adjust your written content. You can highlight sections of text and use the AI toolbar to focus Blaze's efforts just to those sections. And of course, you can edit and write text manually as well. Any changes that you make to your visual or text posts are saved until the post goes live. Okay, so now that you know how to view and edit your posts, you can easily review and tweak any and all content that Autopilot makes for you, giving you the ability to be as involved or uninvolved as you want. If this video helped you at all, give it a like. Also, consider subscribing to our YouTube channel so you can stay up to date on all the ways that Blaze can help you grow your business.